do, do you want me to lead into it, John? I'm just going to yeah, recycle. I, I don't Joe. know anything about what this is, so set, at least tell us what this is. It's probably the worst way to watch this. Uh, they <laughs> were introduced in the latest <laughs> season of Clone Wars. They're the Bad Batch because they're they're clone. They're not perfect clones of Jango Fett. They're like, yeah, I, I wouldn't say defective because it also kind of gives them more heightened abilities. So they're kind of like the group that's sent in, like almost like special ops type thing, and gotcha. you give them the missions that you know nobody else wants to. Okay. The bad Batch. Yeah. They're clone true that? 99. Yeah. <laughs> really, the big takeaway, John, is God that it. it's that a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. All right. Gotcha. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. And then the, it, the time period is wizards. like the transition of the end of the Clone Wars to the Galactic Empire and just okay. seeing that transition gotcha. of them becoming that Imperial Army and clones being phased out or getting with the program. All right. You guys want to watch it? Let's Let's do it. Let's watch it. A test is in order. Five enhanced clones. More capable than an army. That's my dude. I like Rogue One. Yet they exhibit a concerning level of disobedience in disregard for orders. Two skills. German suplex, bro. German oh, yeah, suplex. But they don't have a German either. <laughs> Uh, That's like some sort of horror band. Our squad's <laughs> nothing but trouble. Doesn't look like Tamar Morrison at all. But we yeah, get the job bad done. Time. You'll climb Force 99. Yes. You know this is like another child princess. Hunter? Let's go. I thought it was a boy. Hyperdrive's online. It's like perfect light up. That's a lady. Let's blow something up. It's feminine. Yeah. And cross here. Your move. That's sick. We're all you need. It's the Davis of the group. I was just I gonna say, I like that big burly Davis looking dude. I'm gonna say this is like has enough comedic relief for James. Hey, it's Chicken Hanga. We need to get out of here. It's like the Leonardo DiCaprio meme. What do you say, kid? You want to come with us? How can I help? You can't help at all. You're a yeah. child. It's, it's a like every sci-fi thing. property that has that little kid mascot with The Clone Wars have ended. Uh, oh. You can either adapt and survive. Both are real. Oh, okay, so laser swords are okay, laser bows aren't? No. <laughs> decision is yours. It's like a, like a regular taxi cab, like they're We do what center. we do. Strap in, I don't kid. think these guys are going to turn the empire. Uh, Did they just kidnap that kid? That yes. is a lady. I think that's a boy. That's a, boy, dude. That's that's a, a boy. girl. No, it's not. We're We're Mark, that look, tiara? Mark, look it up. Mark, look it up. Uh, no. I don't. I don't it's know. A space no, it's, against, They're unisex. it's against my being. It, like, dude, like up. the things you wear in Kotor look kind of like that. What? Yeah. That, yeah. That it's, a it's, a up by three it's a circlet, you noobs. Jesus. Yeah. It's, Christ. Yeah. Exactly. It's a lady. <laughs> Go thing. back to chopping wood. I've seen, little games I've seen the never-ending <laughs> story. Okay. I've seen the never-ending story. That's some a of us are wearing cowboy hats with the games we're playing. I uh yeah I don't like that uh that really that nerdy one of the Bad Batch, but the bulky Davis one, the sharpshooter. And leader leader one look cool. leader I gotta say, cool. I don't have any concept of what the hell's going on in this thing except like a lot of action, uh, which might Star be Wars. okay. I'm yeah. I'm down for it, but it like aside from them kidnapping a child and seemingly the child being came willingly. So are they are they like <laughs> a team or like a team and Suicide said. Squad sort of? <laughs> no, I mean. Well, maybe now, because, I mean, before this, they were just like a part of the military and government. So I don't know what's going to happen here. I mean, obviously, they're not getting with the program. They're not going to be happy yeah. with the Empire becoming the Empire. So. Gone bad. Bad batch. Which is actually good. Yeah. The hey. layers to this. Yeah. Yeah. This is like the early 90s. It's so bad. Well, that's why <laughs> the guy had the long hair and the headband. There you go. Looked like Solid Snake. I like him. I, I dig it. Uh, but J Jeff, you're probably the most knowledgeable about this because I think you watched the most uh, Clone Wars. I wanted to jump it. on because I thought you were going to be like hatefully ignorant towards it because you you hate Disney cartoons and you kind of hate <laughs> Disney stuff. And I wanted to be here to defend it. I wanted to listen to your <laughs> ignorant rant first and then uh, go, wait a minute, bitch. Actually, the Bad Batch was super popular <laughs> in the last season of Clone Wars and people are excited about this. Did I disappoint you? <laughs> What kind of stuff do they do you in that last season? You become more open-minded. 
<laughs> and somehow that's a bad thing. It's weird. I it's, don't know. It's, that it's match is good. My open mindedness is bad. Uh, I don't really care for that animation style, to be honest with you. I never really have. Uh, yeah, but I mean, they, but I get I, that that's just keep the aesthetic. The yeah, yeah, that's it. Would be weird if they aesthetic. changed it. Correct. Yeah. I think I think actually think it looks quite a bit better though than than Clone Wars did. Well, I mean, it's it's made you know more recently. I mean, Always, it, yeah. Disney's yeah. taking credit for the last season of Clone Wars because they aired it, but they aired it because I, they needed something. The reason it never aired on Adult Swim is because Disney bought up Star Wars and then basically pulled the plug because they refused oh, yeah. to let Cartoon Network have a successful Star Wars show. Right. And I think they had to like fill out in a little bit more. I don't know if the season was complete, but it was mostly intact, you know, when Disney purchased it and killed it. And they only brought it mm -hmm. back because everybody hates everything that Disney created. Mostly. Mostly. Yeah. Well, Mandalorian mm -hmm. people like it. Yeah. yeah. Some people. I think it's not on. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of people. What, 75% of the people on this video? <laughs> That's a huge chunk that don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I mean, some people are just not going to back the Disney products. I get it. Yeah, I'm getting more and more into that. Uh... <laughs> That sphere again. We'll see. I feel that old familiar feeling welling up. Ah, inside you're not me. as open minded as I thought. All right. <laughs> it's, it's, Flow it's, through you. Yeah, and hate. if I'm back, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm thinking I hate stuff again. Uh, <laughs> Mark, what do you think about the Bad Batch? Uh, I haven't seen Clone Wars, so I, I don't know much about it. Do I like a ragtag group of troopers? Sure. Are are they all good guys then? Is yeah, this... they're a team. But but they're good what? guys. Well, yeah, I mean, I'd rather they were I'd in the military. They they served in the Clone Wars against the the droids, the Separatists. They fought against them, like mm -hmm. every other clone trooper. I'd rather see a series about like stormtroopers, though. Well, that's not. Well, what I the mean, this is sort of. About. <laughs> I kind of like so this then... era of the transition, so I'm kind of looking forward to seeing what it's like because it's always like the the dark cloud that was over the prequels is the Republic was awesome, and I enjoyed getting to see what it was like at its height. And then you know, seeing yeah, the decline in the of films that showed that. So, <laughs> <laughs> if this is a bit like Rebel Commando and, and whatnot, it, it sounds I feel like pretty that, like that Obi Wan meme where it's like, and he was a good friend, and he just <laughs> 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 rocks back <laughs> silently, <laughs> awkwardly. <laughs> oh, God, <laughs> I mean, it was a fine trailer, you know. <laughs> What can, what kind of stuff can we expect them to be? It, it was doing better well? than uh, whatever that trailer was, where that uh, that Mandalorian chick like shot paintball stuff at the at the ship, which or is not what Star Wars Rebels was like at all. I was so pleasantly surprised once I started watching that show, and she was actually pretty cool. And they killed people in that too. There you go. Yeah. See, so maybe they'll kill people in the Bad Batch. Start with that little kid. Well, they did. I'll be happy. Well, they're gonna blow stuff up. No, no that kid's girl. gonna be killing people with his light bow. Yeah, I don't like that kid. That's the one thing. I just can't, but I get it. So you know, it's for it's who it's for. So I don't know. I th I thought it was a pretty cool. It's what they all were for. Yeah, I understand that. Okay. <laughs> for everyone. Because you're starting to age out doesn't mean that you can hold them to a different standard. Sure it does. <laughs> for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> I mean that that is a good point though. They could make programming for adults and also make programming for children and, and get get like the whole life cycle out of their content they could they don't but they could i think it's i think it's better business model to make it for kids and piss off the fans as they get older because we keep watching it and yeah. uh <laughs> i mean mandalorian's like not a WWE fan mandalorian's Wait, not a kids program eh. it's definitely no, it's a not. family show though i would have watched that as a kid i would have yeah. loved the mandalorian as a Dude. kid as, yeah, as, as a kid, Friday nights that would have been so much not, fun. But it's not, as a kid, the Mandalorian would have show. blown my mind. A Star Wars, like real Star Wars movie. I mean, it's something that kids really enjoy, but it's something that an adult can sit through, and that's what the Mandalorian yeah. is. Yeah, I don't think it's for kid kids. I don't Unless think it's for like, four year olds. Gone. But I think I think you know, like eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's a good age range. It's for a Star broad Wars, audience, yeah, for sure. And that's your toy yeah. consumer market. I mean, that's who you want watching that stuff. Yeah, exactly. I buy the toys. <laughs> well, yeah, that you do. You will love this child. You can look at them. Uh, <laughs> Here, play touch. with the box. This one you can play with. <laughs> Kids love boxes. Yeah, it's a good toy. They do. Why it's it's a Hall of Fame entry. All right. Well, it remains to be seen if kids will love the Bad Batch. We'll leave. We'll leave it right there. Oh, Bad Batch is already popular. That's why. They yeah, that's what that's what you're saying. Yeah. They're, yeah. They're uh, they're over. <laughs> 
I used to be over. All right. Thanks so much for uh, watching this far in Nerdosphere. Be sure to like and subscribe. Check us out on Discord if you want to get in on the conversation. That's bestdamnerdshow.com slash Discord. And if you got a few uh, credits that you'd like to share with us, bestdamnerdshow.com slash Patreon. <laughs> I sure would appreciate it. <laughs>